A man is known by the company he keeps. I also remember another proverb. Tell me about your friends, I will tell you about you. Such is the influence of the company, the friends on us. Definitely our family members influence us and the elders influence us. But those are all in an upper position, in a commanding position. So definitely we pay attention to their words and we obey them. But in the case of friendship, there is no obeying, there is no command. It's all a friendly atmosphere. We can take it or leave it. In that atmosphere, whatever activities our friends do, that makes us to mingle with them and start doing the same activities along with them. That is where we are seeing in the childhood days. The smoking habit comes to the uh, children because of their own friends. So good or bad, everything comes through our friends. Since it is very, very important that we have to choose good friends, good company. In this area, definitely the guidance given by our family members are very, very helpful. They know what is life. They know how the people behave. So whatever they gave and whoever they direct us to be friend with. If we choose them, definitely our life will be a happier life, a successful life. Otherwise, in that age, in that adolescent age, we will get lived with so many emotional, adolescent feelings. If we get some bad company at that point of time, definitely that will turn our life into a disaster. Hence, we have to be very, very careful in choosing the company and choosing the friends. In that way, our parents or elders are definitely helping us. We have to thank them. And once we get mature, we have to use our own wisdom to choose our friends. Have good friends, not the best.